Hey, what's going on guys? Tim here again. Got another tutorial for you today. This is the Cobra Knuckle. So this is a hybrid design. Um, it was arranged by Makumbet and you can check out his um, Instagram link down below. But it's a hybrid of the Cobra Knot and the Knuckle Up, which was done by Ken Jamina. And we've got this really, really awesome design. A little bit wide on this one, but um, really cool. And um, especially when you use contrasting colors like this. So yeah, that's what we're doing today. And I hope you guys will enjoy this one. And this one was a lot of fun to make. All right, so if you're looking for where to get Paracord, remember to check out all those affiliate links down below. And of course, a huge thank you to my Patreon supporters who are really helping out with this channel, making these videos possible. Uh, if you're interested in the exclusive giveaways and tutorials on my Patreon page, feel free to check out those links, link in the video, as well as down in the description. All right, that being said, let's get into the tutorial. All right, so to start this bracelet off, I've got a four strand core double cow's hitch. Remember, if you don't know how to do these bracelet setups, you can check out the links in the description box down below. They will always be in the description box. Okay, so I have my uh, secondary color and all I'm going to do is take this off and behind here, behind uh, the buckle, there's the two cow's hitches. So I've got this end of the paracord. I'm just going to put it right in between here. Okay, so from the back though. So through here, oops, not right there. You want it in between two cow's hitches. Right there, see? So I'm gonna pull that through. And then I'm gonna put it through the other side. Same area, see, right there. Okay, so if you've done the bracelet setup like I have, you should have this exact uh, same setup and you can put the feed the cord through like that. Okay, so let's get that nice and even there. I guess you could have gone like that way too. But get those cords nice and even and now we are ready to start tying our bracelet. So to start this pattern, I'm going to start with our um, main color, the Cobra Knot. I'm going to take the left side, I'm going to go over the core, so over all four middle strands, right over top of that cord, and out the other side, like so. Then from here, you're going to take your orange cord on the left, and what you're going to do is you're going to pass it through the little crook right here bring it mostly through and then you're going to close this knot up almost all the way like so push that up and then from here you're going to take that orange and what you're going to do is you're going to pass it through the top of this loop like so like that. Okay, so you can see what I'm doing. And I'm going to actually close that inner loop up a little bit. It's going to make this a lot easier, trust me. So cinch that one up a little. And then I'm going to actually loop it around one more time through that loop. So I've melted this end of the paracord so it's a little bit stiffer. And I can just pass it right through here. Okay. So we got that, that's the knuckle up part. See, I've got that loop through twice. I'm gonna show you a kind of looser version of that just so you can understand what's exactly going on. We'll do that on the other side. Okay, so that's one side. Now we're gonna continue. You're gonna tie another uh, Cobra knot. Okay, so remember always follow the same lead cord. I'm gonna tie the Cobra knot. And just to loosely show you what the knuckle up looks like, in case you're unfamiliar with this knot, is that it goes through the top, like so. And then all you're really doing is going two loops around that cord. That's one, like so. 
and then two. Okay, so if you look at the knot really loosely, that's what it looks like. But the reason we're doing it the way I showed you is just so it makes it easier to keep all the um, the slack out. So let's do this again. So I'm going to tighten that up. Make sure this cord goes to the back there. Push that through. Okay, and then now from here. I'm going to go through this space right here. Push that right through. That's one. Then I'm going to go again. Okay, there we go. So that is the pattern. And I'm just going to go one more time, another set of two knots just to make sure it's clear. We can go a little faster though. So again, cobra knot over the middle core cords. And then what you can do is just take the cord on the left, pass that through. Like so and then you can just tighten this, push it up. So you can pull it out like up to there because there's still space for it to go through. And then cord through. One loop. And a second for the knuckle up. So try to keep these um, these knots on the side. Try to keep them as tight as possible because they don't um, they don't stay that well by themselves. Okay, there we go. And then now let's do one more. Let's bring that there. Bend that through. And then an orange cord on the right, two loops. One. And two. You can use a FID for sure if uh, that makes it easier. I'm sure it will be a little bit easier with a FID, but I just don't want those heavy metal FIDs clanging around. Okay, so. There we go, we've done two sets of knots and we're just going to continue this pattern down our core and when we get to the end, we will figure out how to finish it off. So just continue this pattern going down. All right, so I'm done weaving my bracelet, come down to the end. For the green, we can just snip and cinch them where those are, they're not too bad. And for the orange, you could do that as well, just clip it where they are and uh, melt them. But maybe what I'll try, I'll just feed it through maybe right here. You may need your fit for this. I'm actually just going to open this up with my uh, hemostats there. Okay, let's get that one through there. Let's see how that looks. Yep, that looks fine. So I'll do that on this side too. Just put it through this guy right here. Yep, that looks good to me. So we'll just snip and singe the green where they are and the orange back here.
Okay, and there we have it. We are finished. Again, so there is the Cobra Knuckle Knot. Again, this is a kind of hybrid of the classic Cobra Knot and the um, Knuckle Up by Ken Jamina. And this was uh, kind of arranged together by uh, Makambet. So huge thank you to all those guys for, you know, their patterns and their work. And this is the result we get. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. And uh, remember links for um, all the paracord and stuff I use in the video. Links down below. And guys, if you enjoyed this video, feel free to hit that like button. It does really help me out a lot. And also, if you're not subscribed already, you want to see more content like this, feel free to subscribe and turn on notifications. Guys, thank you so much for watching. See you in the next video.